Hi everyone, today we are going to be talking about creating video overlays with transparency in PowerPoint. A popular trick for making presentations super dynamic with very little effort is to add video overlays with transparency. The thing to remember is that in PowerPoint there is no direct method to make a video transparent the way you can with a picture. So how do we create this effect? Today I'll be showing you three super easy methods to do this. So let's jump right in. For method number one, let's begin by inserting a video onto a blank slide. Once inserted, go to playback, change from in-click sequence to automatically, and also check the loop until stop box. This ensures the video plays back as soon as you go into slideshow mode. Having done that, go back to insert and add your picture. As soon as you add the picture, you can go to picture format and go to the transparency box and choose the amount of transparency you want to give it depending on if you want the video to be more visible or the picture. And as soon as you do that, you have an overlay created. Now if you're working on an older version of PowerPoint, you may not have the transparency option over here. So for that, let's go to method number two. In method number two, let's once again first add our video to the slide. And this time, instead of inserting the picture directly, draw a box over the video. Remove the shape outline. Right click on the box, format shape, and go to picture fill. Once you've inserted the picture, you can adjust its transparency. So that's what you do if you have an older version of PowerPoint where the transparency button is not available. And for method number three, let's try a different trick where we add transparency to the video instead of the image. So let's insert our image first. Then over this, let's insert our video. Once again, change the playback settings. Then go to animations, add animation, and under the emphasis options, select transparency. Then let's go to the animation pane, remove this trigger and select this to run with previous. So as soon as you do that, PowerPoint adds an animation of transparency to the video which automatically kicks in as soon as you play the slideshow and the image is visible from behind it. So that's method number three. And as a little bonus tip, you can use any of these three methods to create really interesting business slides as well. I'll quickly show you how to do that. You have stop video options available right here in PowerPoint. So you go there and find the right kind of stop video you need. Insert it onto your slide and then insert another stock image. Crop this image to fit the aspect ratio of your slide and drag it to fill the slide. Now let's send the image to the back. Select your video, change the playback options and then 
rotate it slightly and drag it so that the entire slide is filled with this video. Let's bring our image back to the front and add some transparency to it. Let's take a look. So now this image in a dynamic way is conveying growth. So these kind of little tricks can be used to make your presentation a lot more dynamic and interesting even in a business setting if not a creative one. So those were three quick and easy methods to really jazz up your slides and make your next presentation a lot more lively. If you find this content helpful, hit the like and subscribe buttons to help out the channel. Thank you for watching and see you next time.